It's been about two weeks since the 2019 general polls, and security agencies are still making efforts to rid the state of post-election violence. In Taraba State, the Nigerian military has made an arrest of 44 suspects in connection with electoral violence. The violence, which led to the imposition of a compulsory curfew in the state capital, Jalingo, has been brought under control as the army hands over the suspects to the police. We have gone around all the flashpoints, not in isolation, but in collaboration and in conjunction with other security agencies. And the suspects seated behind me are those that we intercepted during the course of our operation. They were also intercepted with dangerous and offensive equipment. Speaking on the post-election violence and security situation in Jalingo, the State Commissioner of Police says they are on top of the situation. I noticed that the most serious criminal offense here is kidnapping. Therefore, myself and my management team we established a policy and strategy to fight kidnapping. Uh, not only kidnapping, of course, including other heinous crimes like armed robbery, rape, and murder cases. In all this, after the election, we succeeded and made a remarkable achievement. With all hands on deck to put an end to criminal activities in the state, the Commissioner of Police says that based on the governor's approval, amnesty should be granted to the criminals, who he hopes will repent and embrace peace so that they can be reintegrated back into the society.